Okay, in this section, we're going to talk about fractions. I get a lot of questions. People come up and ask me, how do I get from a fraction to a decimal? And again, it kind of takes us back into when we were a little bit younger, so we often forget these things. So in the very first one we're going to look at is let's, let's take one-fourth and three-fourths and two-fifths, and we'll go ahead and we'll break those down. And realistically, all you're doing is you're taking the top number, okay? You're taking the top number and you're dividing it by the lower number, okay? You're just dividing that. So remember, whenever you see that division sign or that, that top line, uh, just make sure you just know to divide. So in this first one, let's look at this. You just take one fourth, okay? So what you would want to do in your calculator, you take one and you divide it by four. And if you go ahead and plug that in, that's going to give you 0.25, okay, 0.25 or 25%. And the second one, if you just do the three-fourths, so three-fourths, so you take the three and you divide it by the four, and that's going to equal 0 0.75, 0 0.75, okay? And my suggestion when you're taking the test, you probably know these things off the top of your head, um, but go ahead and spend the time and just plug it in the calculator. You got it with you and it kind of helps and keeps you online and prevents any mistakes. So the last but not least, let's look at two fifths, okay? So you just take the two and you divide it by the five, okay? That's going to give you 0.4, okay, 0.4. It's going to be equivalent to 40%. Another really good way to remember this is if you want to go ahead and you want to take uh, T-G-I-F, okay, T-G-I-F. And in this case, unfortunately, it doesn't mean, thank God, it's Friday, okay. However, it does mean top goes in first, so top goes okay in first okay so when you're doing it on the calculator just remember if you want to make it go from a fraction to a decimal the top number okay is going to go in the calculator first okay and that's all you got to remember and again the number um the numbers are all the same whether they're small or big it works out the exact same way